Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel, American Girl Bliss. So today I have a very special video for you guys. And um, so I was scrolling on eBay a few days ago and I saw this really good deal with a lot of three retired Girl of the Year American Girl dolls. And it was only $100, so that's like about $33 for each doll. And some of these are from like a really long time ago, so I just thought that I would unbox them and then maybe later I could fix them up and resell them. So basically, yeah, I'm really excited so we won't keep you waiting any longer. Let's open the package. So, a thing that I forgot to mention in the intro is that um, the pictures of these dolls weren't very clear, so I couldn't really see what condition they were in, although um, the first doll I know is very, very dirty, so she's going to need quite a bit of cleaning. And also, I didn't know that there were like clothes or accessories. It looks like some sort of cheerleading pom-poms or something, so I'm going to open these up. So first of all, we have this really cute pair of blue pants. I don't know what they're from. They kind of look like pajamas to me, but yeah, this is the first thing. Um, next we have this little red kind of jacket thing. I think it's so cute. It has cute little embroidered like flowers and apples on it. And this is really cute. I don't know what it is. And then there's cheerleading pom-poms, which will actually be perfect for my doll that does cheer. Pretty sure that's what these are. So, um, the first thing is like a pair of these purple ones, and it kind of has a little band right here for the doll's arms to go in, so that's fun. And then there's, looks like one pink one and another purple one. So yeah, that's what's in this bag. So now... Let's reveal which dolls I got. So, I honestly really don't know how they all fit in this package. Like, if you really look about how could three dolls fit in this? It's a miracle. I feel so bad for them. They're all squished. But anyway, the first doll I got is, drum roll please, Luciana Vega. She is Girl of the Year for 2018, and she's the one that I know for sure was really dirty. You can see her face. It's kind of a disaster. And her hair looks so like, I don't know. It looks pretty thick to me, but also like, uh, it's so shabby. I don't like the way it feels. And of course she has her signature purple streak somewhere here. Oh yeah, right there. So she comes in this our generation skateboarding outfit. I know for a fact that that's what this outfit is because I bought it myself. And then also there's this custom dance thing embroidered on the shorts, which doesn't come with the actual outfit. Her limbs are, I think they're okay. They're not, oh, this one's pretty loose, but her arms are actually really tight. So I'm happy with that. And it looks like she has the bangs that are sewn on separately instead of just part of the wig. So yeah, this is my first medium skin Josefina mold and I think Lucy is so cute, so really excited to have her. So moving on to the next doll that I got. This is, drum roll please, Miss McKenna, what's her last name? Brooks, Brooks. So this is McKenna Brooks. She's girl of the year 2012. She's a gymnast, and she has a light skin Josefina mold with blue eyes and long straight caramel hair, which is beautiful. And she doesn't have any part in her hair, so it kind of just all goes back like this. If you look at her face, it's honestly not as dirty as I expected because, like I said, I really don't know what I was getting to myself into. Sorry, I really didn't know what I was getting myself into when I purchased this lot, but yeah. And she comes with these adorable little tennis shoes. I don't know what they're from. And purple underwear, I think. Oh, uh, yeah, that's her meat out, meat underwear. And then she also comes with the Truly Me outfit, the old retired one. So yeah, 
yeah, that's my first two dolls that I got. And now for the last one. This is, so we have to just like slide it out. Okay, so this is, drum roll please, Isabel Palmer, Girl of the Year 2014. So she's a dancer. And I think she's like nine years old in her story or something like that. The doll, all of, like all these dolls, the hair feels really kind of dry and it's really, really tangly. But I'm not complaining because still, like for $33, this is a pretty good deal. So, Isabel comes in this white kind of dress with a purple thing around the waist. And she comes with, oh, she comes with two shoes. In the picture, she only had one shoe. I was like, why bother giving me one shoe? So, yeah, this is how she looks close up. I'm extremely happy with this doll and so, so glad that I got her. So, yeah, um, these are all three of the dolls I got. Plus, I also got some accessories and I am so excited to fix them up and possibly customize Luciana into a boy. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with her yet. So, yeah. Overall, I think this was a really good deal, and I am so happy and grateful to have purchased this lot on eBay. I'm actually pleasantly surprised because I was honestly expecting worse condition from these dolls, and I think I'll be able to fix them up really nice and either keep them or find them a new home. So, yeah, that's it for this is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, please subscribe and like if you want to see more American Girl content. Thank you so much again for stopping by my channel. And I will be posting fixing up videos of all three of these dolls in the future. So stay tuned for that. So that's all I have for you today. Bye. Thanks for watching.